Hello everyone and welcome back to another Universe Sandbox 2 video and today we will be making both of Mars' moons the same size as Mars. This will be pretty interesting. I actually got this idea from um, when I saw or when I looked back at my Saturn video I made where I made all of Saturn's moons the same size as Saturn. I thought I'm going to try this with Mars. It could be quite an interesting result what we get. So yeah, I thought let's give it a try and let's make a video on it. So let's go straight into a... Um, new solar system simulation here and let's get going and also while i'm quickly setting this up guys apologies for the um, lack of videos recently um yeah i've been quite busy um with work and stuff so yeah i've not had much time i've been quite worn out but yeah i thought i'll go ahead and make one today just to keep you guys updated and all that stuff and also damn the subscribers right now the count has gone up so quickly like um i think it was last time when a few, three, i think it was two or three days ago now when we live streamed we were at 240 or no 640 subs now but now we're at 663 as of making this video like that is insane i just can't thank you guys enough you're awesome and why is mars's first moon all the way out here okay i'll just delete that and um quickly add them add them in again so let's go back to mars let's press add moons to planet and there we go that's how it should be like that so here we are and if you didn't know these moons are very very small as you can see by their radiuses here like yeah, these things are very, very small, uh, or very, very tiny. So, there we go. And also, um, just to clarify, guys, do you want me to make a video um, when I go on holiday? Because I'm going to um, Florida, if you didn't know. And obviously, the NASA Kennedy Space Center is there. So, so do I make like a vlog sort of video on that? Because a lot of you guys in the stream did want me to do it. So, I'll leave a comment in this, um, or a comment for the video, or a comment on this video saying, should I make a video? Um, at NASA and um, yeah, see what you guys say like like it or just reply saying yes or something like that But anyways, there we go. So if you didn't know as well Mars is that's its radius there. So 3390 kilometers. So we are gonna put that into these bad boys here. So let's do it. So 3390 like that and It's all blacked out. Why, why is it? Oh, it's doing that glitch again <laughs> Dang it, alright, so we're just going to do it so we can just see the moon. I know it looks a little weird, but can't really do anything about it. When you make objects like this, this big, it just makes them all blacked out and you can't really change it. It's kind of annoying. But anyways, 3390, let's do that. And let's quickly close it, reopen it, and there we go. So we've got three objects here. They're both the same size as Mars. We've got Phobos and Deimos here. This is going to be interesting, so I'm going to make them orbit Mars as well and see if they can actually like make a binary system here or if it's actually not going to work. So imagine if they formed like this. So we're going to slow this down. We're going to hit play. Now, is this going to work? I'll be very interested if this works. So Mars is tearing up with Rouge Limit and it's completely eaten Phobos. I'm not surprised because they were so close to each other. There's no way... Um, and it would have been able to orbit a binary thing from that distance. It's just way too close. So now half of Mars is a completely glowing orange colour. <laughs> it's completely molten rock. Now we're going to see if Deimos here is going to do anything. So this will quite, probably be quite a short video as well, guys, because there's not really not really not much I can do with just two um, two objects here. And why is it flying all the way over here? Okay, it looks like it's actually breaking away from the Mars system. So that's not too good. Mars is 12 Mars is in or 12 moons in size now. That's pretty crazy stuff. All right, so is this actually going to stay? Or well, no, no, they're going to break away. So, quick conclusion to that: these would actually break away. So, not good, I guess. <laughs> so poor old um, Fo or Demos here has actually broken away. I think I'm actually going to quickly revisit this and see if we can. Or I'm actually going to see what happens if I don't press anything at all, and just see what would happen if I didn't press orbit. So are they just going to crash straight into Mars? I'm assuming they are, so 3390 again, like that, and then 3390, and then let's quickly uh, change their colours, oops, change their colours so we can actually see where they are here, so there we go, alright, now, I know I put both moons as red, oh well, alright, um, okay, I forgot it was playing too far, why is this all the way out here, alright, we've got to do that again, sorry about that guys, alright, so we're going to quickly, um, Go back to Mars. We're going to slow down time this time. It's annoying how it started. It plays really fast. All right. Add moons to planet, and then three three nine zero, and then this one as well. Three three nine zero like that. And then let's um, change the um, display mode so we can actually see these guys. And now let's slow down time again. Now let's hit play. So, so Phobos completely gets torn apart by um, Rouge Limit here. So as you can see, it's going to collide with Mars again. It's pretty cool. Look at all those... Look at that. It's just so pretty. 
I just love this game. Wow. Look at that. Even the music changes when you get a big collision as well. And it looks like Demos as well is going to do it. Because sometimes when you play it faster, you get a different outcome. So this is what would happen if it is more close to real time. So Mars would just completely engulf both moons if they were to suddenly increase in size. I know it's a little unrealistic they do that. But yeah, if it ever did happen... Yeah, that's what would um, happen. So now Mars is a lot, lot bigger than it used to be once it eats up all of these the remaining material here. As we can see, when we made the moons larger, they also gained a lot of mass. So now Mars is almost 16, so 15.9 masses of the moons. So it's a lot larger than it used to be. Because if you didn't know, let's um, open this up. Mars is meant to be 8.73 moons, but it's almost doubled in mass. So that's pretty good. Right, so let's get rid of all the um, fragments. Oh, no, we can't delete them, damn it. There used to be a command where you could do it, Control F, but now that doesn't work. It just opens this menu up. It's kind of annoying. All right, so let's delete these fragments like that. Oh, let's look at all these. All right, let's delete all them. And we're going to get a quick comparison with the um, other planets in the solar system. Maybe Mars's orbit changed from that as well. So let's get a quick look. And no, 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 it didn't. Its orbit has barely changed. Okay, interesting. All right, so let's get a look at the. Um, planets now so how large is mars so mars has gained slightly still not as large as venus but it is a decent size larger than what it used to be so if you guys want a quick comparison here as well with the original size of mars there you go so it is larger so um pretty cool stuff a little bit larger all right so that is pretty much it for this video guys that's a little more of a shorter one than usual but there's nothing wrong with that right like <laughs> so looking good yeah, nothing wrong with that. Like, I don't mind doing shorter videos. It's more of a variety of um, video size. So sometimes I usually make about 20 to 30 minutes and editing that and like uploading it takes longer. But a nice short video like this, nice, it can just upload easy, no problem. But anyways, enough of me babbling on making the video longer. Hopefully you guys all enjoyed and make sure if you did, leave a like, subscribe if you're new. And also tell me, should I make a video in Kennedy Space Center in NASA in Florida? Like, should I do it? I, I think I, I may do it. I think this would be a good idea. I'm pretty sure you guys would also enjoy it since it is space and it's pretty cool. So, um, yeah, that is pretty much that. So, um, like I said, hope you guys all enjoyed. Leave a like, subscribe if you're new, and I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye.